The U.S. has imposed sanctions on three Russian entities and one individual involved in transfer of North Korean ballistic missiles to Russia. While both Pyongyang and Moscow denied the allegations, Seoul says the arms trade is evident. Kim jong she reports. The U.S. State Department has imposed sanctions on three Russian entities and one individual involved in the transfer of North Korean ballistic missiles to Russia, which then used them against Ukraine. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken in a statement on Thursday said North Korea's transfer of ballistic missiles to Russia supports Moscow's war of aggression, increases the suffering of the Ukrainian people, and undermines the global non-proliferation regime. He added that the U.S. continues to closely monitor any Russian-provided support to North Korea in return for these weapons and will use all available tools to designate and expose individuals and entities involved in the arms transfers. Meanwhile, Ukrainian President Zelensky said Thursday that Russia has received over one million pieces of ammunition from North Korea. Speaking to reporters in the Estonian capital Tallinn during a tour of the Baltic region, he called for more support from Western allies to defend against Russian missiles and drone strikes. The Russian deputy head of the Security Council gave a chilling warning on the same day. It's known that we use different carriers with different loads, except for the nuclear one just yet. Regarding Wednesday's UN Security Council meeting criticizing Pyongyang-Moscow arms transfers, North Korea released a statement denying the allegations. The regime state-run Korean Central News Agency reported on Friday that North Korean ambassador to the UN Kim Song said Pyongyang doesn't feel the need to comment on America's, quote, unfounded accusations. South Korea's unification ministry told reporters on Friday that North Korea has avoided giving a clear denial of the arms transfers. The ministry added that the arms transfers between Russia and North Korea are evident and that they are a violation of UN Security Council resolutions and an illegal act. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.